Let's talk about music production, how to speak your workflow when you're saving your sound. Hello my friend, welcome back to the channel. This is Jose Velez from jvcreationstudio.com. You can check it out, I have free multi-track and more. So, a uh, long time ago when I started in uh, music production and all of this with the computer, I remember I have a friend and I was telling, hey, I'm doing production and finding sound. And he was more experienced than me but that time. And he looked at me and, what are you music are you doing? And I was like, mm, I'm just looking for, for sounds through my library and checking those sounds and and spending more time. And he said like, wow, yes, that's fine. And then the following week, what are you doing? Oh, I'm checking the sound, spending, you know, from, and he was looking at me like, you're wasting your time, make music, find your sound, save those and make music. And I realized that I was like starting to get in the habit of just finding the sound and not making music. So I went to then to start making a uh, saving uh, in, in, I have a saving area, favorite sound, but if you don't have that in your DA, just uh, write it down in a piece of paper. So when next time you're doing your music production, you are not spending time finding the sound. You already have the drum that you have with the EQ, with the compressor or, or kind of uh, something basic to get you started. Your strings, your piano, your bass and everything. And I'm going to show you how I do it here. And if you have a template, it's even better. I have some template, but I don't have much of template. So I have to work more on tape, but at least I have my sound safe and ready to go. So let's get and dive in. I use Resong and I also use Studio One, but this time I'm using Resong. It's pretty, it's completely clean. There's no channel, but let me tell you what I mean. Uh, here in the left side, I have saved my sounds, my preset. And if I don't have it saved here, I know because I've been looking around where to start. So let me start with the uh, piano. So we can have an idea. I just dragged my piano that is already. It's gonna open. And then it's going to be ready with all my sound, with all that is safe in this combinator or the EQ, the reverse and everything. And let's do four bar. I'm going to change it so you can see me play. There you go. Okay, so that's uh, the piano then uh, in G for a basic idea with four chords. And then I'm gonna look for a drum. So I have a couple of drums that I already like. Just drag and drop. And that way your idea is gonna be quickly and faster because you already spend the time looking around. So no, right now I'm not looking around for any drums. I'm just gonna go with this one, which is a combinator from the recent kit refill. And here we go, I'm just gonna play it. Something, but let me take the loop off. Okay, so that was quickly and fast. Uh, I'm not going to do anything else. Let's get a bass. See, I have a couple of bass I already like. Let me take the first one. So I already spent my time looking for the bass. 
so I'm not gonna do any more looking just gonna grab it it's uploading the sound and it's ready and here we go. let's play the bass Yes, I forgot to do the G over here. Let's do it real quickly in the piano. And it is a right. What you got the idea? Should be high. <laughs> Let's do it high. <laughs> And then I'm gonna grab a strings, which I already have somewhere here. If I find the strings section, which is here, strings. So I have it by, by viola, violin, cello, but this time I'm gonna grab a string section completely. And let's do some strings. something quick and fast so it's not perfect but you got the idea that if you are laying down music production then you are not worried about the sound you're just pulling down a couple of ideas and getting there and I did a another path now I'm gonna do um, Dr. Ox this is for looping drums and all kind of stuff and then in the factory I'm gonna look for the doctor drums loop I have an electric one and then I love this one see but I already have a couple of favorites, so then this is gonna be in a loop. So let's, let's listen now what we have so far. <laughs> so that idea is not perfect but see and then quickly you have your idea so yeah please if you like this content I'm gonna try to start making more short content because I'm realizing it's too long and uh, subscribe smash the like uh, give me some feedback some comment and see you next time so remember release a new sound this inside of you bye